What's up guys? This is the Rifleman and I am back to bring you to the next episode of my Empire Total War. Let's play as the Kingdom of Bavaria. And in this episode, we're going to assault the city of Boston and take it back. Well, take it from the 13 colonies. We can't take it back because we never owned it. And yeah, I think they're going to fall pretty nicely. So let's kill them all. We have a large contingent of native African troops, which aren't the best. Um, but we also have Gurkhas and they will... They are more than able to cleave straight through the enemy line. <laughs> as soon as we make a breach, we're probably just going to push in. The enemy has no howitzer or no mortars to cause us problems. So we can slowly start to uh, approach the fortress as we make our breaches. And as usual, we have our howitzers to help uh, knock some holes in the enemy line. them all together they're all gonna be they're all gonna be cooperating for now uh, so going in the breach we have our Gurkhas plus some line infantry then on one up on one flank we want three units of native infantry on the right flank we have three actually we have three units of line infantry plus two skirmishes our Royal Cairo Infantry Guards are going to support the push through the breach. Cavalry and the General hold back. So right now they're all going to focus on making a breach. I mean, they've, they've just completely ignored me. Oh uh, yeah, the enemy is actually able to put a lot of fire out through those seekers so let's spread my infantry out let's spread my cavalry out let's spread my car infantry guards out i'm going to speed up time because the artillery duel i mean they could cause us quite a lot of problems if they went for our guns rather than um went after our troops Oh, they sniped on my general. Oscar, no. He's the only one. They took out two men. And they, that's the one they got, they got my general. Anyway, keep on engaging. Boom. Then once things have, once they've made the breach, I think my Howard is going to start engaging the uh, the enemy guns in the center of the fort. They killed one trailing team, but they didn't knock out any of my guns. Boom, boom, boom. One more volley from my howitzer should probably... Well, they won't do it. Boom. Boom. But then my howitzer, my foot artillery also pivoted to engage someone else. Okay, right, let's start running. So I'm not overly worried about fighting in the breach. So you guys are shooting and you are... Okay, you are gauge... Oh no, they do have um, garrison mortars. Okay, in which case then... Quick climb it is. Let's get both these howitzers to clear out that quick climb unit. We're pushing in multiple multiple directions at once. We're going to make the atypical solution of charging straight in rather than forming our defensive lines. There we go. That's thinned out the enemy mortar crews. Six men remaining. Let the let the let the fire keep working. So okay, you men scale there. You men scale there. You guys climb up here. You 
ghost climb there. Ghost climb there. Start hacking away in the militia. Where's my Royal Pyro Infantry Guards? Push them forward as well. Let's push one unit up. Yeah, they're sending more guys in, so we are going to match that. Throw in another unit of infantry. Let the howitzers go to work on trying to clear out the centre. Ah, oh, these guys, they're trying to go around and attack my native African infantry before they can climb the walls, I see. So you men are going to be engaging the militia right off the bat. Oh, chug time. Yeah, I guess it's going to be all of this. I wonder if I take my... If I take my howitzers and say... Danger close, quick climb. And it is danger close, quick climb. I do love a bit of... It's nice to attack, get them just to drop them on the centre. I'm, I completely accept uh, the risk of danger close. The Gurkhas will not be annihilated, but I want to see this. Let's speed up time. I know all it's doing is making, all it's doing is making it chug more. Come on. Yeah, my infantry is scaling the walls, which is really good. My skirmishes are getting up. So you men engage the militia as well. So if these guys hit the breach appropriately, that could that will just knock it. All. This is the reason why it's slowing down so much. So if we can. Okay, I'm going to speed up. I'm going to triple speed it. Although that's... Whoa, speed. Keep mashing the play button. Okay, there we go. Bombs away. I don't see the shells. I hope they haven't missed. Or they haven't... They've gone for the right target. Fired short. There we go. <laughs> and did you see how the screen just completely went? There we go again. <laughs> Cease fire. There we go. That's that thinned them out. Ah, oh, screenshot. Hee <laughs> So I might have killed some of my own guys, but, I mean, tell me that wasn't worth it. So you guys are going to clear the militia off the wall. You guys take position over the gate. You guys don't get involved in the combat. Oh, the chug is back, but it's not so bad. You guys are going to cover the gate. Okay, if you give them an order to kind of readdress their position, these guys sometimes, there we go, they're going to spread out. So they'll get up there quicker. 25, 30, 10, 36, 21. I mean, look at all those guys that are just gone. So many dead. Again, the militia here is down to half numbers. You men get over the gate.
When these guys find they climb up, they'll shoot down into the combat, although they might actually just charge off the wall. Same as with both of you guys, actually, just head down here. You guys will secure the gate, which means these guys will all start to run through the gap. I wonder if we knock out those guys, if that'll help. Yeah, they're going down. The Gurkhas are seeing to that. That's what I wanted to see. The skirmishers have taken position here and now they're picking off probably the gunners. You had, we have orders to charge the 63rd. To be honest, I might even just pull, if I pull my colonial line back. That's helped immediately. There you go, they're shattered. There we go. So they're picking off the gun crews. If you guys can, run to the house. going after. I mean, just keep killing them. That's two units that are actually shattered. You can charge my native troops if you like. I do not care. That's another unit broken. You could charge down here, I suppose, technically. You wouldn't be needed to kill this militia unit. Yeah, they're almost gone. There's only two left. One left. Zero left. Get off the walls. You're charging down. There's a unit of militia here on the on this rampart. Some of these guys are stuck in the rubble. I mean, yeah, look at all of these casualties. That's just so beautiful. First regiment of militia trying to hold the line. Yet yeah, the cavalry tried to get to my skirmishers, but most of them are in. guys. Oh, are you still picking off the gunners? Yeah, you probably are, but that's okay. Ah, oh, the enemy cavalry charged out the gate, but I don't really care. Two men left in the 80th regiment. One man left. Yeah, we're clearing our way through. A few men form up, you can engage. Engage whoever you like, to be honest. You guys push down here as well. They're firing into the centre as well. The gunners are dead. Bring down the skirmishers. we're actually squeezing the enemy defenders up top. Now we can make you guys just run in. Kill the last of the 22nd. Only six of them. Form a gun line right in front of the, the enemies in the square. Everyone has marching orders. 
ignore the fight, get straight in. Gurkhas block the block the rampart so that my men can just run through. Oh no, they've still been drawn in. Uh, just charge, charge the enemy general. Get my skirmishes in as well. My, eight, my African native infantry tearing their way through the gunners. Skirmishers are going to have a good go at them as well. The new men come in. General's bodyguard are the most dangerous unit here. Everyone else is just fine. There we go. The men at the gates finally broken. Victory is ours. Now we just have to kill the last of the gunners. Which we have done. Yeah. Quite an interesting battle, really. I mean, danger close quick line. Glorious. But that is Boston secured for the Bavarian Empire. I need to get this converted both to our religion and get all the buildings upgraded. Excellent. So they've got a. They are a Protestant territory. Upgrade the roads. Get, get rid of the College of Divinity. Get rid of the College. I mean, my general got sniped by a cannonball, but David Kallenbach. You're all ready for the fight. So you're replenishing. You're replenishing. You're ready to push on towards Cayuga. Um, you might actually just siege them for a bit, just see if we can get a bit of... Actually, you may as well just attack them. Lionel Bonner. Let's take him out. Quebec will fall like the rest. It appears these have basic settlement fortifications rather than improved settlement fortifications, which it would make our, it makes our quicklime that much more deadly because they'll be um, packed in. Unless I read it incorrectly and they have improved ones. But yeah, if they have basic settlement fortifications, then there's no... It's more difficult for the enemy to avoid quicklime. Because they're so packed in. So I'm going to deploy over here. How it says deploy as close as you can get. My guns can be a bit more free up here on the high ground. Guns have long range, so they've easily got coverage. So then... These men go in the front. Let's create... Actually, let's get my expats together on the left. Regulars together on the right. Combine my cavalry. Yeah, they can't. Uh, just come how it's just shoot at whatever they want. Just on the walls, really. Put artillery, engage the enemy defenses. He misses a, actually kidding, hitting the cavalry in the centre. Nice. Although I may actually get. See if I can try, see if I can do some trapping. My how it's just to hit here. Just chip away the walls and then let my foot artillery just crack open this sector. Yeah, they all stopped firing as I gave them an order during time compression. Keep going. Not a few men off the walls. So the hope is I can destroy this section, then rapidly retarget 
my foot artillery against the other section of the wall, which should which should be could be destroyed quite quickly. Okay, good. So redirect fire. So my howitzers shoot at the weak section of the wall. Then my artillery shoot at the other section. Because the howitzers will knock this knock this down easily enough. Although they're actually shooting it whatever they like because time compression orders. You're not fucking you you're bugged, which isn't great. You guys all Yeah, they're all shooting at the correct section of wall. Howitzers can knock this down. That would be super duper. One more hit. Good, they got a few kills. Engage that section. Uh, we're not going to get any... We're not going to use trapped, but we're going to get some kills on it, my god. Well, actually, you guys could climb this cluster of fellas right here. Misfire. Push up. Get the guns to shoot it whatever they want. How it says clear them out. Oh, good hits. That's a large amount of enemy KIA. So what is it you guys are shooting at? Maybe these guys on the wall? Maybe? Let's just try... Yeah, let's try go for them. So they're going to go after this section here. I mean, it might just break the wall down. Which wouldn't be terrible. More quick climb away. Good hits, good hits. Let's run my assault divisions, otherwise they're not going to be involved. Because of these three... I want two units to assault and then one to block the gate. Good hit through the middle. I think it's mostly we're going to destroy that section. These guys are a bit... This the, this attack is a bit vulnerable. Or quick climb. To be honest, you should probably just shoot it. One of you needs to shoot up here. Start clearing out this sector. 123rd. Give them their orders to progress to certain points. I don't care that they get tired. They will sleep when they are dead. Just form positions to engage them. Misses with the quick climb. Okay, they got armed citizenry. Okay, actually the garrison, the um, the grenadiers have left the wall. The fourth have gone down to the centre. Let's retarget. Quick climb. Oh, the gunfire is just engaging the sensor quite nicely. 
I hear a charge. Yeah, they're coming in. So your job is to drop into square. Defend against the colonial light cavalry. Yep, they may well break. Because attacking a wall like this is a risky business. As long as you get your grappling irons up, when they come back, you will be able to do the job. So if you go secure the gate, that will prevent them from pushing through at all. Excellent. We don't want to go through the gate. We want to get up on top and shoot. Get up on top and shoot. Secure this wall. The brave expats. See, the only one you can pick out is the officer with his bright blue cloak. Well, there goes the drummer. He's charging in. He's had enough. Everyone else is holding out in front of the gates. Grenadiers guard mode on. Okay, you need to get up there fast and start shooting. It's unfortunate that they are electing to try and move through the gates. Many, many, many dead enemies here. They can send their cavalry after us as much as they like. They can send their militia up to us as much as they like. But if they don't stop us, we're going to mount the fire step and just pat this, fill this area full of bullets. These men are securing the wall in fantastic style. So you may kill the militia. You may have to go through the gates to do it. These men are going to charge down the step here, otherwise it's never going to work. Howitzer, switch to round shot. Engage these grenadiers in the center. These grenadiers are going to push through this gate. New men are going to hold this breach because they seem to be massing. Hopefully, if these grenadiers can cut through here and make a good dent, the 123rd is charging down the fire step towards the armed citizenry. No, don't. I don't know why they were running around. We don't even own that gate. Just climb up. Excellent. Lots of routing men. Oh, it's a shoot the light infantry in the center. So my grenadiers have gone in. They're drawing in the enemy troops. So we need 123rd to chuck, kill these last 10 biolock armed citizenry. So if you kill them now, you should be climbing up the wall. Climb up the ladders. Kill them. 
not climbing down off the wall. My militia, my grenadiers, my grenadiers and grenadier guards are leaving their way through the enemy. Though your light curve might cause us some issues, but now you guys are in position. Man the fire step. Engage the cavalry. There you go, fire as she bears. Okay, you men charge through the gates. With sheer courage and determination, we're going to secure this wall. One unit's going to push off the wall, start to threaten the 4th Grenadier Regiment. There you go, you men charge down off the wall. You men are engaging the troops in the centre. You're engaging this unit of militia, then there's going to be a unit of cavalry to kill. You men have to. You men are going to charge the grenadiers. I don't want them to be unmolested. You're going to go after them. You're going to go after the fourth regiment. There we go. Now we're clearing them out. It's the thin white line stopping us from getting towards the centre. We have killed... they forget that we have killed many men to get here. The human get off the walls. You've captured them with, with the loss of many lives. However, your sacrifice is not in vain, so you men will get here. Form up and engage the enemy with musketry. You men kill the last handful of militia. This regiment of foot's continuing to engage. Center. Charge the colonial line. They elected to advance. I mean, my cavalry would be doing a great job about now. All my cavalry, give them an order to run in wherever they see fit. Whether you may... This infantry unit charge to the centre. My grenadiers carry on mopping up. You guys have done your job well, as have you. Get down. Oh, there we go. And they've all broken. Excellent. Enemy general will successfully... We well, won't flee, we've got the city secured. But they will die. It is your attitude and the suspicion that you are maturing. No, well, it doesn't matter. There goes Quebec and all of their ships. Good job they spent a bunch of money building those. <laughs> Build, build, upgrade, sloop. Cool, cool, cool. Got pirates to the south. The question is, can I just push on? Actually, have I got any sloops and so on? So if I drop a sloop there. Well, sixth rate, I'll take I'll take a sixth rate. Sixth. Spare ship. Okay, you occupy here. So that that covers us from from enemy action trying to cross over and attack Quebec. We push out. Uh, we can't push out. We have no movement points, but we should be able to storm on and take Montreal quickly. Um, but apart from that, yeah, you're replenishing. You're replenishing. You've got Saint Augustine, but you're repairing. Gonna build roads, but you're also replenishing. You 
are going to siege Texas. Just to try and cause them some attrition. They'll probably attack us anyway. Mexico is secure. Can we leave you out? Move you out? Minus five. Certainly not. Plenty of building. You're marching up towards Antigua. You're marching down to Bogota. You're still pushing Caracas. Or holding... Well, to be honest, we've already fought that battle effectively. Yeah, we effectively fought that. Chomp. Upgrade, upgrade, upgrade. Ah, there they are. Bartolome Marin. Chomp. Okay, you men get back to the coast. We're not likely to need to hold this. We will be pushing out of it. Um, because we're, we're storming towards Bogota, which has no defences and a bunch of... Actually, has a bad general. Nice. Uh, so they're, they're going to be taken. Antigua's going to be taken. Panama is being Panama. So in Jamaica... Let's recruit a bunch of sixths because we need to be ready to transport um, our armies. Okay. New Haven is being destroyed. Let's hit and turn. Yeah, you're a bit out of. You're a bit out of place now. That army that landed in Mexico. Thirteen colonies want peace, unsurprisingly, but they will not get it. And they've got plenty of armies to defeat in the meantime. Good, they fortified Albany. Oh, there's Louisianans. No, they're not deploying. Iroquois, they are now our enemy. Okay, we will fight this battle, but I'm going to quickly go get a coffee before this happens. So just a second, everyone. And I am back. Right. Let's get ready to fight the Native Americans. I'm a kind of <laughs> big mouth. <laughs> oh, yeah, big mouth. Uh, but yeah, so we're going to get ready to fight. And you've got to be, be ready that the reinforcing army is the one that's going to cause more problems. Because uh, that's the garrison coming in. And I'm, I'm kind of ready to lose this battle but cause a good amount of damage. We have two other armies on the coast. So if this army kind of gets mauled in their push, then I think that'll be okay. We've got plenty of, we, we've got so much firepower, we can afford to lose, you know, five or more armies, let alone... Ooh, actually, this is kind of handy. We can afford to lose loads of armies. I wonder if I actually just pull back to this... Pull up, nah, although... This is also good. Okay, I am going to deploy. If the map make, if the game makes sense, we have one band coming in. We have a band coming in on our left, and then we have a bunch coming in ahead of us. I mean, in before they all show up behind me. Something like that. It's a reasonable reserve to deploy wherever the bulk of the enemy force comes in. Okay, so it made it made sense. Okay, right, right, right. Desert warriors. Oh no, you're okay actually. So let's put one unit of chevaux leger on each flank, especially because they're able to shoot. That's super useful. We want our Gurkhas on this flank with a bunch of infantry in reserve. These 
gunners engaged, the reinforcements coming in, you guys shoot at them. Where's my company cavalry? Company cavalry, boom. Okay, go scouting. Because the enemy cavalry itself I'm not uber bothered about. What I do want to do is keep an eye on, there we go, the shrapnel shot range, because Chief's bodyguard, I mean all this cavalry would be great if we could kill. Actually, where's my hero right, surplus skirmishes? If you can get up there. Chevrolet Leger. Gonna get their volley away. The native lancers. The 11th light foot have had their say. Counter charge with my skirmish cavalry. Hoping to knock them out. Medicine men spotted. Yeah, they do a lot of damage off the charge. Who's that coming in? That's the chief's bodyguard. Canister shot. Where's my Gurkhas? Bring them out. Looks like they're going to try and hit this regiment of foot on the flank. Charge the Gurkhas in. Make sure my colonial lights fire it all off. Excellent. Okay, I'm probably going to want to be a little bit more aggressive on the right flank. Bring back my company cavalry. Push up my Chevrolet Leger, fire it well on, because you've got another tribal gunner unit coming in. Kill the enemy general, that's always nice. Let's push my Chevrolet Leger forward towards the tribal gunners. You men pull back my artillery focus on the uh, focus on the cavalry coming in. Chevrolet Leger should be reloaded. It looks like they might we might be able to get a couple of shots off against all these chaps. Push forward. Retreat. Well, no, no. That actually, that's it's really tempting to push because they're bowmen. But there's two units of bowmen together, and I don't want to do that. Trap was sharp. Blast them. Get you guys back here. Reloaded. Who's that? Medicine men coming in. Wrong unit. No, no, no. The opposite. Firing off. Shooting on. Gunners cast a shot at musket men. One of you break off and chase down the uh, medicine men. They've shattered, so well they've routed, so I want to make sure they route. I'm back here on this side, still opening up on the bowmen. That's all good. Artillery canister sharp. Let's pivot you guys because you're not very useful. There. You guys pivot like that. Navajo scout warriors. Should just shatter the medicine men. We just want them to good, shattered, come back. Garrison native bowmen, so you need to be careful th about them. That might be a trap. Demon smash the bowmen. It's the medicine men, it's the runaway. Navajo scout warriors are doing some damage. 12 pounders engaged, they must get them with canister shot. Get my Chevrolet Leger back here. Commit my Gurkhas to counter the charge. No, you men commit into the native. Actually, you men commit into the bowmen. You'll also hit the Native American warriors. 
were being hit between Chevaux Leger and Gurkhas. Pull the, call the Gurkhas back. Shattered. Keep killing the bowmen. Shattered. Okay, hey, right. Come back. Come back. Reload. Although, you guys. Okay, medicine men. Gurkhas, get over here. Gunners, mount your guns. Okay, you guys. Okay, we managed to beat the... Are you being... Yeah, you got chased. Okay, right, let's just get you guys. No, not all of you. All, not all of you. Get back. Safety. Who's that coming in? Native American warriors. Get the Gurkhas in. No, keep reloading. You men cease fire. Get my desert militia over here. Get everyone back. Get this line to form up. Shrapnel shot the medicine men. She might shrapnel shot. Oh no, the musket men are routing. Yeah, shrapnel shot the medicine men. You men all form line. Get the Gurkhas over here. Because here come another unit of Native American warriors. There's another unit of Native American warriors. If they break, we'll pursue them with the Chevrolet Leger. Gurkhas hit the warriors. Third volley coming in. Third volley. My gunners are routing, but that is to be expected. Charge into the flank of the warrior society. Okay, pull back. New men form up. Expand the warriors. Get the company infantry up here. Okay, you men move over. The backstop, the left flank. The right flank, rather. You men fall back. My light skirmishers are getting massacred by bow fire. Bring my cavalry back across. So you have shattered them. Bring them back. Gurkhas go for the Warrior Society. You just get in. Cavalry get over onto the right flank. Native African infantry. Keep on killing the Warrior Society. Cavalry charge. You men charge at the back of the Warrior Society. They may be steady for now, but they're about to be surrounded. Where are my good girls? You guys should chase off the bowmen. shattered. Get my Chevrolet Leger out of the way. You men are starting to get sufficiently low on numbers now that you can add your, add these uh, musketeers into the mix. Okay, let's form our defensive line again. Nope, Chevrolet, get out of the way. Okay, 
you go, my light infantry are engaging. Put the warrior society back into a rout. The Native American warriors are pushing in, but they're being engaged. A musket fire. Counter charge. Yeah, I'm, I'm not looking to obliterate the garrison army. The garrison army I want depleted for the follow up. When you men run, flee from these guys. There we go, getting some kills. Swing into the flank of these Native American warriors. Kill a few more fellas. Did we, who did we kill? Did we kill Big Mouth? We did kill Big Mouth. That's what he gets. Okay, you got a fresh bow unit, Native Warrior unit. Okay, ultimately, I want to pursue, but it makes sense to uh, just pull them back. Did they come back? They did come back. Again, focusing on my skirmish unit on the flank, because that's who they can beat. But yeah, recall my cavalry. I'm going to speed up time a little bit, because right now my line is now fully reloaded. Get ready to engage. Yeah. Bowmen, warriors, sighty Native American warriors. This gonna get up on top of the hill. You've chased them away again, but I don't know for how long. You've run out of ammunition, that's cool. charge forward again the brave souls however our lines are reformed they are even less able to provide a military effect than they used to be back you go you devils so you want you guys to get up here fire it will on and have at him You can start picking off the bowmen once the foes to the front have been dealt with. Oh, you have no ammunition. Very well, colonial line, you're back into the line. Fire it will ready. Make ready. Fire! Yeah, they've been pushed back. This regiment's fully loaded. And the skirt, the, the light infantry's gonna do some real good work here. Well, they need to reload by the looks of it. Keep up the pressure. Break off the attack. Huzzah! Yeah, that is it. Whew. Dodgy, but not close. No, 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 no. I would disagree with that assessment. Back you go. Cherokee and the Huron want to get up to some mischief. But we're about to take Canada. So if I hop up to the Americas, actually let's do meteorites. Hey. Let's drop you here. So I think the Cherokee want to have a bit of a rumble. Yeah, Jesuit College is fine. Let's upgrade. 
some of these buildings in in Florida, including a trade port. Push to the border. Let's keep on with the upgrades. Good sugar plantation. Oh, all the mines in Spain need to be brought on to brought online. Okay, yeah, you can get back on your boat. And land here. <laughs> yeah, land. Make landfall. Uh, let's see if let's see if one fifth rate can blockade their fleet. Yay! Okay, so what it might do, you men may replenish and storm the Santa Fe. One of you men go after Texas, which, to be honest, I may ought to resolve after that last action. So you effectively fought the large battle, including, well, the biggest enemy force. Yeah. And you men push to the border. I mean, let's send one of these rakes to Upper Louisiana. Let's send the other of these rakes to, I don't know, Chicasa. So we did all the stuff in New Spain. We saw Spartan Army Staff College. So many plantations. Good, good, good. Oh, we did all the stuff in Florida. You got basic dirt roads, but that's not enough. Go. Church school in Hyderabad. Nice, 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 nice. So. By a large, huh? Oops. Sorry about that. Just actually what my microphone. I'll check that. 20 minutes. Okay, let's get you guys aboard. over to the Americas. Okay, I have to put some put something together with these remaining troops. And you, Mr. Faber, holding at Barabad. Although you can't you can you can actually leave in a few turns. Catholicism is on the rise. So you are almost about to get Antigua. You are about to get Bogota. <laughs> Good, get you back up to the coast and get you replenishing. Right, right, right. Everything is looking okay. A lot of fighting can be done here. Yeah, yes, Quebec. Can this army leave Quebec now? It can. Okay, they're going to just storm Montreal. Iroquois are going to be a threat here. You need to take them out. You... You're replenishing. Okay, let's get a church, school, and a craft workshop. So we can get one of you guys just to siege Albany to prevent them from doing anything. You cover this... Actually, maybe cover this bridge. Just to prevent them from heading east. 
you're going to push up towards the Urukard, see if they attack you. It's probably more important that we secure Bogota. Let's take them out. And then, yeah, that's going to be quite a good get for us. And we're going to see... <laughs> Well, it's the the uh, new Spanish Empire is going to be left down to two provinces, one in Guatemala, one in Santa Fe, and I think the enemy are about to. Well, we we are storming towards the completion of this campaign. All my artillery on the high ground, with as clear a field of fire as I can get. How it's as born. We're going to form a general infantry line with a goal of surround and destroy. We'll go for quick climb shot, knock some holes in their infantry formation. We may not make it to exactly where we want to be, but I want to be trying to get there. And I'm only speeding up time just because... Oh god, actually we've made... Okay, maybe let's not do that. Cavalry on the right is going to be very useful. There are pikemen on the right, but you're going to stay there so you can shoot for a turn. Then you're going to push. To be honest, I may as well just push you both. Ah, oh, there we go. So the enemies allowed us to run right up to their face. These are my grenadiers up front. They're going to tear you open. Although... There we go. Present. 10th Regiment are down. 23rd Regiment nearly down. Danger close quick climb. Push these two units up the flank. Keep the cavalry pushing ahead. I mean, that's a large enemy retreat. Routing, shattered, 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 broken, broken. Okay, keep. Retarget the howitzers. Retarget the guns. Guns can focus on the enemy cavalry. Okay, keep the Lancer Guards moving. Horse grenadiers hit the colonial pikes. Oh god, that guy went flying. Broken. Immediately. You can't even, you're not even able to shatter them. They're running so fast. Oh, they're dying. They're running away so quickly. Push, push, push. Everyone here who isn't cavalry. Who isn't cavalry. Push, push, push. Cavalry fall back. Here's native bone auxiliary. 
push them back to their line of defences. So I want this infantry unit plus you plus you. Oh yeah, switch towers is a round shot because I fear they may do some terrible damage. They're still within range of my guns. Engage the fifth light horse. My cavalry force. Switch to rent. Uh, fire. Fire will off. All they've got is this unit of light cavalry. And they're shattered. <laughs> so yeah, look at that. The actual the kills we got would be are going to be really low. Because the enemy just... <laughs> we managed to make them uh, break and run super quickly. Yeah, so you actually... Oh, they lost all... Obviously lost all of them in terms of kills. The Lieb Regiment. Oh, 140, 88, 376 kills. Beautiful. We can get the territory built up. This is a very valuable region, so obviously you want to crank out those mine upgrades. Get Cartagena rebuilt. Can you guys leave immediately? You can. Get up to the port. Good, good, good. So then we can get a six rate down here to pick one army up, six rate down here to pick up another. We're recruiting a couple more. Minus three. Okay, you know what? Just to make this quick or quicker. Move the sloop out, send you guys in. Embark, disembark. There we go. Land another army in, ready for if they try to take us out. March up another army. So this army here, I mean, they'll go down pretty quick. But one thing I want to make sure we do is have you sieging York Factory. Have you push towards here. We're in right for being ambushed. Oh, no, apparently not. Not yet. We have no chance of making this Catholic until these 13 colonies pro... Um, Protestant missionaries go away. But what I might do is take Mr. Tauber and engage Timothy Mayhew, because that will draw in a bunch of other armies. Yes, it's put what brought in one the garrison at Annapolis is, is coming in. Um, so we definitely want to take this opportunity. But looking at the timer, well, I believe it's time to end the episode. So thanks for watching, guys. Hope you've enjoyed. And we'll see you next time for more Slaughter of the Colonists. Cheers, everyone.